How is she doing? You know what I'm talking about? It's your partner, man. Who? It's your partner, man. You know what I'm talking about, man? How is y'all doing on this soggy Sunday? That, that ain't going to never change. You know what I'm talking about, man? Say what you up here talking about today, bro. Oh, I got to go and fight. You know what I'm talking about? It's soggy Sunday. That ain't going to never change. But this one right here is going to be called Check Yourself. You know what I'm talking about? Before you wreck yourself. <laughs> no, that's too long of a name, but it's called Check Yourself. You know what I'm talking about? I'm going to get into it, but before we eyes do that, what's good, people? Like, he he. Ha <laughs> ha, you know what I'm talking about, man. Ken in the pen, man. All my folks incarcerated, all my folks who ain't, man. Everybody on the bottom of that thing. Everybody on the top of that thing. Keep that head up, man. <laughs> Keep pushing. We gonna get through it to get to it, man. Did I say Ken in the pen? I don't know, but if I didn't, go get that stick up in storage now, man. You can go and get you one off of 76 MacArthur. They sold out. They'll be back. Hey, I'm talking about the Giants. Look, is what I'm talking about. You know what I'm talking about, man. 82nd Hillside. Barbershop. You know what I'm talking about? They say somebody put them in their stores in the hundreds. Thank you, young man. You know what I'm talking about? Now you know, because I tell you every morning now, you know. Man, you can come get them things from me one-handed on you. Did you see it? Hey, you know what I'm talking about? Y'all like that spread, man. You know what I'm talking about? Go get you one. You know what I'm talking about? Did you see it? But if all else fails, and I mean if all else fails, you can go and get you one off of Amazon. Make sure you copy your hardback, man. You know what I'm talking about? Funk or die trying in stores now. Make sure you go to Amazon, copy a hardback. You know what I'm talking about, man. Stick up two coming soon. Funk or die trying two coming real soon. <laughs> he all talking about, uh-oh, what's that? Swain that finger, young man. That one, that's the one, bro. Come on, man. You know what I'm talking about? Come on, Swain that finger, man. Or uh, worldwide, man. You know what I'm talking about? Worldwide INC, man. One more time, bro. Worldwide Incorporated. You know what I'm talking about? They gonna say what does that mean? I'm gonna continuously tell you it means everybody. He on talking about and Dugu Fresh, Mike, Lil Rue, not Lil Rue, Lil Rue. He on talk about Ty Ty the player. That's who comes next, man. I see you, man. He on talking about same thing, man. All my folks on the bottom of that thing. All my folks on the top of that thing, man. Keep that head up. You know what I'm talking about. Keep pushing. We gonna get through it to get to it, man. He you know what I'm talking about. Now let's get through these disclaimers. But before we do that, he you know what I'm talking about. Mama says, and Mama always says, "Boy, brush them whiskers when you on TV, especially on Sunday." He you know what I'm talking about, man. Coffee Chronicles. Piping high, classic roast. <laughs> you know what I'm talking about, man. You get through these lemon now. Good brother like myself, good brother like myself. He on tomorrow. I don't promote no drug uses. <laughs> nah, man. He on tomorrow. Good brother like myself, good brother like myself. He on tomorrow. I don't promote no drug sellers. Mm -mm. He on tomorrow. Good brother like myself. You know what I'm talking about? I don't promote no alcohol consumption. Mm -mm. He on tomorrow. Don't take a sip. I mean, I sip other sip. Is he on talking about? Don't do it. He on talking about. Your brother like myself. You know what I'm talking about? I don't promote no crime. Mm -mm. He on talking about. I don't promote no violence. Mm -mm. He on talking about. I don't promote no domestic violence. Mm -mm. Keep your hands off the people. People. He on talk about. I he on talk about. Don't. You know what I'm talking about? Promote. You know what I'm talking about? No. Negativity. He on talking about. No. <laughs> no, <laughs> no, man, be, man, all I promote is y'all go ahead. He, I'm talking about, and do what you're going to do with your time, young ladies and gentlemen. Make sure you find the right thing to do with your time, young ladies and gentlemen, because we just don't know how much of what we got, young ladies and gentlemen. But a good brother like myself, I ain't prejudiced. Mm -mm. He, I'm talking about, good brother like myself, I ain't got nothing against the sexually different. Mm -mm. He, I'm talking about, good brother like myself. He, I'm talking about, I ain't got nothing against the little people. He, I'm talking about, nah. <laughs> me, man, I ain't got nothing against nobody. He, I'm talking about, they was talking to me. Man, I just love me some everybody. You know what I'm talking about? Matter of fact, I'm on a quest. He, I'm talking about, bring that peace. He, I'm talking about that joy. You know what I'm talking about? That love. You know what I'm talking about? That love. Back to the YouTube community, man. You with me? Come on over here. Fuck with your partner. All right, all right, all right. Check it out, man. Come fuck with a nigga. One time, he on talking about, man, how is you doing, man? He on talking about, how is y'all doing on this soggy Sunday? They ain't gonna never change, you know what I'm talking about? This one right here gonna be called, check yourself. He on talking about, before you wreck yourself. They <laughs> gonna say what's wrong with you, bro? I don't know. Coffee Chronicles, you know what I'm saying? Uh, shout out to everybody who ain't never started a fire, but they hemorrhoids just flared up. <laughs> <laughs> <coughs> 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 
fire pot. <coughs> <clears throat> a double five pot, you know what I'm talking about? Man, how are you doing all oh, this? Is gonna be a real quick one. <laughs> yeah, idea. Coffee Chronicles. And this one right here is gonna be called Check Yourself, man. On the soggy Sunday, they ain't gonna never change. Say, bro, what you mean by Check Yourself? Oh, I'm finna get into it. <sighs> Nephew, sis, old man, old lady. Hey, you know what I'm talking about? I'm finna get into it. Check yourself. That's really just a uh, self-explanatory. You know what I'm talking about? They say, bro, where you get all them words from this morning? <laughs> but look, man, as people, and I mean as people, man, uh, this is what we just don't do, y'all. We don't never check ourselves. You know what I'm talking about? And frankly, I'm sick and tired of it. You know what I'm talking about? I know ain't nobody else going to tell you. I'm sick and tired of it. You know what I'm talking about? But as people, we don't check ourselves, man. And by us not checking ourselves, you know what happens? We flow through this thing that we call life. And everything the fuck we do is somebody else's fault. It ain't never our fault, even though we did it. You know what I'm talking about? We always do something because it's somebody else. You know what I'm talking about? And that's a... You know what I'm talking about? If you do that, that's fine. You know what I'm talking about? I'm just here to tell you, man, as people, we need to check our motherfucking self. You know what I'm talking about? Now, y'all don't be paying attention, you know what I'm talking about? Because we just be running around here indulging in all these uh new activities they done gave us, ain't we? You know what I'm talking about? All these new behaviors, you know what I'm talking about? All the destruction and all this shit right here, right? And that shit lead, all that shit does is uh they showing the people how to be not accountable. You get what I'm saying? Not accountable for disrespect, not accountable for their mouth. It's just a free-for-all. You can come out here and say anything, you know what I'm talking about? That's why this shit comes with great responsibility. You know what I'm talking about? All that shit leads to you not checking yourself. Because you got a scapegoat for everything. You know what I'm talking about? You finna go do something, but you already got your excuse in your hip pocket. You know what I'm talking about? It's just like, uh, see, I don't know. This is for the people who's been to jail. You know how you used to go up to jail, man, and everybody tried to get up there with the, you now the judge done seen this shit. The judge been up there 20 years. And somehow a motherfucker think they're going to come up there what they always start off with. Well, Judge, I had a rough childhood. <laughs> you know what I'm talking about? Man, half the people on this thing we call Earth and had a rough childhood, man. Ain't a nigga, you out there, that shit, your childhood ain't got nothing to do with that shit, folks. That's just the excuse you're going to use. You talking about your childhood, nigga, you grown. You know what I'm talking about? You grown. So if you still talking about, nigga, if you still using your childhood as a motherfucking uh, excuse... Somebody need to kick you in your ass with boots. <laughs> you know what I'm talking about? They just do it, man. But we need to check ourselves, folks. We just do. Because uh, despite what you might want to tell yourself or some bullshit like that, bro, whatever the fuck you do, it's your fault. Whatever the fuck it is, good or bad, bro, it's your fault. But we done got some motherfucking use of deflecting, you know what I'm talking about, and shifting blame and just, you know what I mean? Out of nowhere, always, when it comes to us, somehow we change the subject, you know what I'm talking about? It never gives back to us. So then guess what that does? It allows you to continue to just walk around this motherfucker with no accountability. Because no matter what the fuck you do, it was a reason. And you know what I'm talking about? Like, everybody ain't got the reason. I don't know, but fuck it. But on a soggy Sunday, they ain't gonna never change. We need to get in the habit of checking our motherfucking self. We just do, bruh. Because you is who you is, and that ain't nobody else's fault. It ain't, bruh. You just is who you is. As a person, you gonna have to change yourself. If not, you just going to be the person who you is. And you just going to have to accept the consequences for being that motherfucker. You know what I'm talking about? Same way I did. See, I can get up here with uh <clears throat> and be proud about saying that shit in today's time. You know what I'm talking about? Because I used to be that motherfucker. You feel me? Stay going to jail, bro. You get what I'm saying? After a while, don't nobody want to hear that shit, folks. That shit on you. It just is, bro. Even though the motherfucker that's going to jail, man, you got every reason in the world why you done took this chance to get to jail. But don't nobody else in the free world want to hear that shit once you go to jail. You get what I'm saying? Don't nobody want to hear that shit. 
They just don't. And I've had a lot of times uh, that I had to check myself. You know what I'm talking about? I done got, uh, I done been up off this, uh, I done put myself in a situation to take myself off earth several times, man. And at first, when I was first doing that shit, I wasn't checking myself. That's how I was able to come back several times. <laughs> hey, bullshit. Nephew, sis, old man, old lady. He don't talk about nephew, sis, old man, old lady. Coffee Chronicles, man. I wasn't checking myself at first. That's why I kept going back to that shit. Then the older you get, you realize this ain't just what you want. You know what I'm talking about? So you gotta, uh, you gotta make a, uh, an in-game adjustment. You get what I'm saying to yourself? But you only could do that when you check yourself, folks. You can't just keep being you and expect people to just like to accept that shit, folks. Now you could do that shit if you want to, but you just gonna run out of people who gonna accept that shit, man. You is. But if we would practice checking ourselves, like we be having our nose and other people's business and trying to find out everything else that's going on, bro, we'll be in a way better position, man. And that's one of the reasons we don't be in a way better position, bro. Because we think that we could just take us anywhere we go. Now, that's all you can do on this earth, right? But I used to be that person, man. That's why I could speak on this shit, bro. Don't nobody want no guns in their house, bro. Don't nobody want you around there with the police. Look, man, it's some people. I ain't never even been to these people's house, bro. You know what I'm talking about? And the U.S. Marshals wouldn't kick them people dough in, bro. Them people held a grudge against me for about 12 years, bro. I ain't never even been out there, bro. The U.S. Marshal wouldn't kick them people dough in, bro. You feel what I'm saying? Don't nobody want to be going through that shit, man. I understand now, you know what I'm talking about? I'll be ready to whoop my ass, bro. You know what I'm talking about? I'm just sitting up in my house, nigga, in the U.S. Marshals. They, they got a warrant. <laughs> I don't even know these people. <laughs> that how the fuck they get a warrant for my motherfucking house? Bro, don't nobody, man, listen, bro. You'll burn people out with that shit, folks. You'll burn people out with that shit, bro. I'm sitting over here, you know what I'm talking about? And my extra activities out here on Earth, you know what I'm talking about? This thing we call the world, you know what I'm talking about? And, and some shit I'm involved in, man. And you know what I'm talking about? They got a warrant for them people's house, bro. I ain't never been in people's house in my life. <laughs> they had a warrant for their house, bro. You know what I'm talking about? So with all that shit, they, when they kicked in, they doing all that. What if them people was up in there doing something, bro? With my bullshit, bro. I just then came and ran it on these people parade, folks. With my bullshit. You get what I'm saying? And until you check yourself, bro, you ain't going to even understand that shit, bro. You gonna make it seem like you ain't the one who told the police to to come there, even though they looking for you. You gonna come up with a rationalization, man. That ain't my fault. I ain't told the police to go kick her door in. You know what I'm talking about? Nah, you didn't, nigga. But the, the reason they kicked their door in because they was looking for you. You get what I'm saying? At some time, man, you just gotta hold yourself accountable for the bullshit you do, man. And that's the only way you're gonna be able to change the bullshit that you do. But until then, man, you just gonna keep on with the bullshit, man. We just need to check ourselves. And it's fucked up in today's world, man. I'm gonna always say this, and I'm gonna keep saying it. Nephew, sis, old man, old lady. He all talking about. He all like that. <laughs> he all talking about. I'm just gonna keep on saying it, bro, because you can have so much love for a motherfucker and love a motherfucker to death, bro. But the way they raising y'all now, bro, is the first time a motherfucker don't agree with you in a conversation or try to, uh, or, or, or tell you no or something like that, the first thing you do is get spiteful and you just hate a motherfucker for no motherfucking reason. It ain't even, where did the love go, man? You mean I can't, I can't be loved I, if I got a different opinion than a motherfucker? It's fuck me. If I tell you no, it's fuck me. That's crazy as a motherfucker to me, bro. But I still love you. To death. And you know I do, you know what I'm talking about? And that's the thing right there, bro. And in today's world, I'm going to get up out of here with this one right here. This is the thing that irritates me most about today's world. Instead of people just being what they is, they try to talk you in. Like, say you just meet a motherfucker, and he trying to tell you, man, I'm the most genuine motherfucker in the world. He trying to tell you this. You get what I'm saying? Bro, that ain't nothing you can even tell a motherfucker. That shit requires action. But it's like a motherfucker try to talk you into what they want to proclaim they self instead of just being that. You know what I'm talking about? All you got to do is be genuine. You know what I'm talking about? And the motherfucker see that. 
But by you keep sitting there saying you genuine, bro, and like that ain't what you doing, bro. No, you're not, bro. Why you keep on trying to talk me into what you proclaim yourself? If you real, you ain't got to keep saying that shit, bro. Your actions going to speak for it, bro. You just going to do real shit. You're going to do solid shit. There ain't no reason to say, oh, I'm the most solid motherfucker you know. And you know what I'm talking about? That's for other people to say, bro. Man, that nigga, hell, that nigga, that's the most solid nigga. You know what I'm talking about? That's for other people to say, bro. You can't talk a nigga. Not me anyway. You might, you know what I'm talking about? There's some nerves out there, so I get why you're doing it. But you'll never be able to talk me into that shit. You know what I'm talking about? If you just watch a motherfucker actions, the words will never fool you. You know what I'm talking about? You can't say nothing and do something else, bro. That shit don't go together. You know what I'm talking about? It doesn't fit. <laughs> you know what I'm talking about? For real, though. You know, the soggy Sunday day ain't gonna never change, man. We just need to take more time out to check ourselves. Because that's the only way you're gonna grow, folks. You might not believe it, but that's the only way you're gonna grow. Because you could just say, fuck it, and I'm just going to be me, and I'm just going to take that shit in everywhere and anywhere. You could do that, bro. you just going to run out of places. You just is. You know what I'm talking about? You could be the way you is, bro. You're just going to have to accept the consequences for the way you is. That's all. You can do whatever the fuck you want to. It's your time. <clears throat> but if you spend more time of your time, you know what I'm talking about, checking your motherfucking self, you know what I'm talking about, you could fix the gray areas with yourself, man. Instead of everybody watching and having opinions on other people's business and what they should do and who should go to jail and all that shit right there, bro. If you check yourself, you know what I'm talking about? You might could clean up some of the gray areas about yourself. We all got them. Coffee Chronicles. Nothing will ever be more detrimental to you than yourself. And that's just facts. In order for you to make it wherever you're going to try to go, you're going to have to fix yourself so you can make it there. You know what I'm talking about? Coffee Chronicles. It's just like the club. You know what I'm talking about? Remember they wouldn't let you in with tennis shoes? <laughs> the nigga went and got some flats. <laughs> God damn. And with that right there, if you already remember that, they always remember. It don't cost nothing. Just to show a little bit of that love. <laughs>